What's going on people, it's Trimmy and welcome back to another episode on this channel and in today's episode we are going to show you how to create stunt races because a lot of people don't know how to create stunt races, surprisingly, but with that being said, let's get right into it. Right, the first thing you need to do when deciding your race is what type of race you actually want. For me, that is the location and the vehicles you're going to use because that's what you're going to build your race around for the title of your race make sure it's something that actually relates to the race for me i'm going to create an f1 track so i'm literally just going to name it f1 for the description it's basically the same thing so for me i'm just going to call it f1 race and you want to leave the photos until last because you actually want to capture everything for when you're trying to load the race and when you are in the lobby screen. For the trigger point, what you want to do is pick a location that you don't really go to. So you won't accidentally walk into it if you're role playing with your friends or if you're just roaming around the city. After the place trigger, what you want to do is use the props. Use the appropriate props to what you actually want your race to be about. For me, I'm going to add different little barriers and stuff like that that's going to be hard to get through with multiple F1 cars and stuff like that, so it's going to be a difficult race but it's going to be a fun one at the same time. If you are using these big objects, make sure you click prop snapping on because then they'll clip onto each other like that. It'll make things a lot easier for yourself. So once you've built your setup to your race, sort of something like this, then you will be ready for your checkpoints. And as you can see, if you go outside, there is a big circle going around the trigger point. This is where your first checkpoint needs to be. After you place down all of your checkpoints, make sure you take your lobby picture inside of this red circle zone here. You'll be able to see it on your mini map and take it wherever you want. After that, don't forget to take the actual race photo as you can see in the top right that's the photo i deemed perfect for this race as it shows every single angle and make sure after that your race is done to its own specifications such as my available vehicles i'm only doing open wheel because it is an f1 style race and it's point to point Just like that, you will be able to save, publish and play with your very own creative race with your friends. 